Escape from Tarkov is a hardcore and realistic online first-person action RPG simulator. This is not why you're here. You want to know what Tarkov really is. I got gotcha. <laughs> Escape from Tarkov is a D game in the friends group that looked at Soulsborne games and said, I can do that. If you're like having no idea what you're doing or what you're supposed to do while repeatedly being smashed in the balls with a sledgehammer, both metaphorically and literally, this is the game for you. This beautiful piece of Russian game development does not hold your hand like others would and it won't offer you something like a tutorial or in-game maps. Tarkov instead spits in your face, looks you deep in the eyes and demands you to thank it for it. <laughs> Like, as they announced the tutorial map, the community was confused on how this would even look like. I can tell you what it looked like. A map smaller than my attention span, filled with mounted grenade launchers and machine guns, a boss that will make you wet your pants, and a bunch of quests that are the most contested areas of the entire game on wipe day. Thanks, Nikita. This game offers a 7, okay, technically 8, but let's be honest, as a casual player, you're never going to reach Lightkeeper, unless you quit your job and say goodbye to your family forever. Unique traders, which give you all the quests and items your heart might long for. Do you feel like creating a beautiful looking gun with the recoil of a BB shooter that will decimate anything that dares to walk in front of it? Here you go. You just want to use this instead? Uh, you know that this is basically just a broom with a chamber slap to it, right? Okay, no, do whatever feels right to you. It's, it's pretty difficult to put into words how disgusted I am, how depressed I am. If you start playing this game late into a wipe, you never even had a chance to begin with because you probably look something like this right now. Brother, uh. And everyone else kind of like this. But if you still don't want to miss out on this experience and you're willing to learn the maps, spawns, extracts, quest locations, quest items, hotspots, scaff bosses and potential angles for sniping, then I'd recommend you try and play Arena as well. You probably have to pay for it separately, but it will make the base game way easier. And you're going to get used to the unique way PvP feels in this game. You won't have to struggle with money or levels anymore. If you did all of that, you might even reach the holy grail of us casual players, the Kappa container. Good luck, you'll need it.